Hello everyone! Welcome back to our channel 100 Ideas. If you have long wanted to transform your site, pay attention to this too. It is an amazingly functional and incredibly decorative material that can change the look of your cousin in no time. Stone is the versatile material that can fit into almost any style of garden decor. We bring to your attention some simple, but at the same time very effective options for using stones in garden decor. Gapion Bench If you are looking for a simple but original solution for arranging a recreation area, pay attention to gabion structures. With the help of gabions, you can not only build a partition that separates the resting place from the rest of the site, but also make an original bench. The set of such structures, as a rule, is made of wood. You can lacquer the wood to make it look natural and laconic, or paint the wood with appropriate paint. In this case, bright and saturated tones will help to set the necessary accents. Decorative Pond with Gabion Bowl Do you want to equip a decorative pond on your site that would require minimal maintenance but are afraid that a plastic pond will not look too presentable? Pay attention to the original solution with a round plastic pond installed in the Gabion Bowl. If you supplement the design with a seat, you will end up with not just an element of decor but a full-fledged place to relax. Stone Pedestal if, after arranging the site, you still have bricks or paving slabs, it is absolutely not necessary to hide them in a barn or workshop in the hope that they will someday come in handy. So, for example, from then, you can build a pedestal for a figurine, flower pot or bowl. The main thing is to choose such a figurine or container that would be stylistically combined with the pedestal. Otherwise, instead of the original decorative element, you will get a design that will cause your garden visitors not admiration, but bewilderment. Dumping from stone The combination of stone and wood is a win-win classic. The main thing is to be able to choose the right materials for mulching. They must be combined according to three criteria – texture, color and fraction. If you make a mistake in at least one of them, the composition will turn out to be faded and inexpressive. Alpine slides Do not think that rock gardens are complex and time-consuming decorative elements. Competently composing a composition is not so difficult, it's much more difficult to fit it into the surrounding landscape. Alpine slides look most impressive in areas with difficult terrain. It is here that the decorative potential of these compositions is best revealed. If there are no natural elevation differences on your site, then it will be much more rational to equip not an alpine hill, but a rockery. Rockery Rockery differs from rock garden in that at the forefront of such compositions are not plants, but stones. However, even if you manage to create a composition verified to the smallest detail, in which there is nothing superfluous, this may not be enough. Just like rock gardens, rockeries are not so easy to fit into the general plan of the garden. Such a flower garden should fully comply with the style on the site. Otherwise, you run the risk of getting not an authentic composition, but a bunch of stones overgrown with grass in the middle of a well-groomed lawn. Gravel Garden Gravel gardens may seem unnatural or even lifeless to some, but it is precisely such compositional solutions that can be an excellent way out of situation where you are faced with the task of arranging a low-maintenance garden. Of course, there are certain difficulties in arranging such a flower garden, but in reality all obstacles turn out to be easily overcome. For more information on how to properly equip a gravel garden on your site, you can read in our separate article. Fencing for flower beds Stone fences for flower beds always look solid and monumental. You can build a fence from any one material or show your imagination and try to combine several types of stones at once. 
A tall flower garden bordered with stones or different textures will look good in an English garden or a country-style garden. Please note that often the term moss means not only plants of the royal fetus department, but also lynches as well as some herbs that look like mosses but are not. Moss Garden Contrary to popular belief, moss is not only a weed that brings a lot of trouble to lawn owners, but also a unique ornamental crop that will come to the rescue when you need to diversify the landscape or equip a shady area of your garden. With its amazing ability to grow on almost any hard surface in minimal light, moss is great for landscaping those corners of your yard where no other ornamental crops could survive. Flower bed with succulents You should not think that a full-fledged flower bed with succulents can be equipped on your site only on the condition that this very site is not in the middle lane, but much to the south. Undoubtedly, the range of succulents available for cultivation in a temperate climate will be several times smaller than that available to the inhabitants of the southern regions. However, even these plants are enough to create a rich and complete composition in the garden. Pay attention to stone crops or and young. Only two varieties of succulents and wood, a variety of colors and shapes. We have introduced you to only some options for using stones in the garden and flower garden. In fact, from much more. Stones are used to create dry streams, waterfalls, or spectacular compositions where one or more stone blocks act as a garden dominant. Dream and fantasize, but do not forget about the golden rules of landscape design, and then your garden will look not only original, but also organic.
In the coming year, the trend continues in favor of natural landscapes. In your beautiful and practical garden, ecology should come first. We preserve local plants, minimize the waste of natural resources, and use natural materials. Use soft cover. The time for paving slabs is running out. If you have not yet equipped your paths, then you pay attention to the options for wood chips or stony screenings. Grassy paths also look great, they're also called life. They really enliven the landscape and make it more natural. You can also sew perennials between the seams of any cover. The wider the indentation from one plate to another, the greater the choice of plants that can be appealed. With the help of such paths, smooth transitions to the main flower beds are created, and the territory looks like a single hole. Limit water use. Thus, you can save water, electricity, and your time. The main water sinks are large lawns that need regular watering. Do not give large areas for them and replace the beautifully flowering in popular petunias, sophonins, and begonias with less moisture-loving plants. Lavender practically does not need watering and in terms of decorativeness it is no way inferior. Place barrels on the side to collect rainwater. Decorate them to match the style of the yard, so you get the right water for irrigation without compromising the appearance of the yard. Help save water and a special arrangement of flower beds. Try to make grooves in the flower beds and fill them with rubble. Crushed stone will act as mulch, which will retain moisture that will collect in the recesses. Make one or more gravel zones. Gravel can be used for arranging a recreation area or parking. Against the background of gravel backfill, many plants look spectacular. A variety of stone crops go well with such a coating. With the help of gravel of different shades and drought-resistant plants, several gravel gardens can be set up. By the way, they have already begun to actively crowd out the once popular alpine slides. Another option for using this natural material is dry streams. Located in the right place, they look stylish on their own, and they can also be used to zoom the site and mass communications. Set up an office in the garden. This trend is dictated by the lockdown, which has affected each of us in one way or another. Many have to work at home, but not everyone has the opportunity to retire. An outdoor study will give you the opportunity to be inspired by landscapes and birdsong. To create an office, both closed terraces and remote corners of the garden are suitable, where no one will disturb you. Give your garden a touch of carelessness. Trends in architecture dictate their own rules to landscape design. Empire and high-tech styles are gradually disappearing, so smooth lines, simple and cozy forms are welcome in the landscape. Try to keep the plants that are already on your site as much as possible. This is especially true for houses that are located near the forest. Save the plants of the lower tire to not touch the ground cover. Best remember that slight neglect is only a carefully thought-out decoration and not your attitude to the garden. Plant a vegetable garden. Be sure to allocate space for several beds. Probably everyone already knows that the garden can be decorative, so do not be afraid that such a decision will make your site less attractive. In addition to fresh greens and vegetables, you will get the opportunity to change activities, as well as a time and place to work together with children. We would even recommend allocating small beds specifically for children and their garden experiments. Believe me, working in their own little garden, they will get a much greater understanding of the world around them and its processes than from the best textbooks.
What should be the entrance area? Beauty is hidden in the details. Pay attention to the signs with house numbers and mailboxes. They create coziness while maintaining a functional load. Unlike new settlements, where the developer is increasingly deciding this issue, a long-established culture of landscaping outside the site is not particularly common. If space permits, you can plant a low hedge of spiraea, cotinister, wild rose or a group of flowering shrubs, lilac or viburnum. It is worth thinking about the appearance of the drainage ditch. It can be hidden by laying down the pipe and covering it with rubble. You can strengthen the slopes with the geocrit, boulders or gapions. Much depends on the budget and style of the site. Particular attention should be paid to the gate group. The materials used should be repeated in the architecture of the house and landscape. This will allow you to perceive the site as a whole, to create a harmonious picture. The main trends in the design of the entrance area. You can decorate the entrance area focusing on your taste, but at the moment there are four current directions. Please read them before you get started. Each can be performed in any style, they differ in their functionality. Openness The territory of the site is built into the overall picture of the area, creating a single space with the surrounding buildings. The fences are low, made in the same style. In order to make the territory of the site more private, we are building a system of green curtains that block the view of the main recreation areas. Fence as part of the landscape, house architecture. Application of common materials, technologies. Increasingly, we use the site as another room, but under the open sky. The space of the house and the street are combined and perceived as a whole. The street becomes an extension of the house. We use similar techniques in finishing. If the house is finished with stone and wood, then the same materials should be used in the finishing of the fence. The same with the color palette. We select shades from those already existing in the decoration of buildings on the site. Techniques that dissolve parking in space. Blurred borders, the separation of the footpath and the main paving. The addition of green islands will come to the rescue here. Increased parking functionality. Possibility of using the parking as a common space for outdoor games and sports. Near the parking lot, you can place a playground or put a basketball hoop. This option is suitable for owners of garages and off-site parking so that you can drive the car and play without fear of damaging it. Decorative colored crushed stone for landscape design is an original solution for decorating a garden area. With the help of such an attribute, it will be possible to decorate not only flower beds, but also to delimit the plot into several zones. We offer you to get acquainted more closely with the features of decorative crushed stone, as well as the technology of its coloring. Colored crushed stone, small stones, fraction from 10 to 15 mm, having a cubic shape, painted in bright colors. At industrial enterprises, special coloring pigments are used, which are resistant to external factors. They are non-toxic, therefore they are safe for solid and garden plantings. Painted gravel crushed stone is also characterized by resistance to frost, UV exposure. Crushed stone belonging to the first class of radioactivity is suitable for use in garden design. In addition, decorative gravel plays a practical role. Crushed stone is often used for drainage, maintaining water balance in the ground. 
passes moisture well, does not allow it to erode. Thanks to the rubble, weeds do not grow on the site. It is used to create compositions, tracks, different decorations and different styles. You can buy decorative crushed stone for landscape design in construction stores. We create colored crushed stone with our own hands. Two types of stones are suitable for coloring. Granite rubble, marble rubble. It is recommended to choose stones of identical sizes for coloring. For the selection of crushed stone, a metal mesh is used, which has small cells to perform sifting. It is not necessary to measure the material to accurate indicators. The main thing is to eliminate large specimens. Before painting, the gravel must be washed. To do this, the stones are laid out on a prepared metal mesh dipped in water. The washed material is poured onto a film or necessary linoleum, left to dry for 30-60 minutes. To paint the stones, water-based and acrylic weather-resistant curbs paints are used. For quick staining, a concrete mix is used. The dried material is poured into a bowl, the paint is poured in several passes, adjusting the desired saturation. The painted material is pulled out of the concrete mixer, laid out on a grid to train the remnants of the pigment. In the absence of a concrete mixer, it is better to buy spray paint. Scope of application Colored stone for landscape design is used to create colorful drawings on flower beds to decorate the recreation area. It is also used to form original inscriptions on pedestrian paths. With the help of decorative miniature stones, they perform revenge around the house, pool or gazebos, paths on playgrounds for children, features at the bottom of ponds, framing garden sculptures, monuments, the decoration of gravel benches, the territory around planted ornamental trees look original. If we are talking about recreation areas in the garden, then they can be different in function. This includes active recreation, badminton court, relaxing by the fire, gatherings with friends, an area with a table or an outdoor sofa, an open area cinema and many other options. In our busy world, sometimes you want a completely different rest. Take a short break, think about what you have done, dream about the future. Nature disposes to such reflections, and today we will tell you how to equip a zone for meditation and solitary rest, how to create it, what to pay attention to, and how this site differs from others. The first step – choosing a place and size. It is advisable to place a platform for a secluded rest in a secluded place, away from other zones and buildings. And for sure, this place should not be clearly visible. Ideally, if you manage to organize a platform under the grounds of trees in the depth of the plot. Your task is to create a green room. The size of such a zone can be any, from 10 to 100 square meters, depending on the size of the site and the function of the site. If you want to create the most intimate space for one person, then 10 square meters will be enough. And if it is, for example, a yoga and a tea area, then they will occupy a much larger area. The second step. We fill it with the main elements. First, you need to create a sense of security. Trees or tall shrubs are well suited for this purpose. Tetra, spruce, turf, lilac, oak, maple. Choose plants with which you have positive associations. Then we move on to the middle tier of plants. 
It can be any conifers or deciduous shrubs up to 1 or 1.4 meters high. Be sure to add your favorite perennial plants or annuals to the pots. Given that this area is isolated from the rest of the site, it is possible to place flowers in a different range here. And the whole site can be in a different style than the rest of the site. Remember about the place to sit or lay down. It can be a garden chair, a bench or even a flooring on which you put pillows or a yoga mat. The third step, decorating the space. Decor elements can be different. Their main task is to evoke positive thoughts and emotions in you, to awaken good memories, to energize. Water. There is nothing more relaxing than watching the water. You can create a mirror of water. It can be a bowl of water, a small pond or a drinking bowl for birds. You can also use water in motion, for example, a small stream, bubbling water or a cascade of stones. It is very important not to overdo it with water bodies. There should be no active movement, loud sound or pump noise. Therefore, a waterfall or fountain is not the best solution for a meditation zone. Visual point of attraction Contemplation allows you to immerse yourself in your inner world. Therefore, you need to install something in the recreation area that you will contemplate. It can be a water object, an evacuate tree, an art object, or a flower garden of continuous flowering. Aroma and sound. We remember about all these senses. Think about what sounds and aromas relax you. What makes you feel peaceful? There is no universal recipe here, because someone likes the rustle of cereals and someone likes the ringing of bells. Someone loves the smell of mint and someone can't stand the aroma of hydrangeas. Choose for yourself. Something personal. The area for a secluded rest, like no other, should be personal. Try to create a special atmosphere close to you. It will be great if it reminds you of a pleasant journey, the streets of Italy, a Greek cafe. We hope this video was useful to you. Like it, write your comments and subscribe to our channel.